What's up everybody? It's Wolf. How you doing today? Today we're playing Eververse again and we're playing on the new beta map. Um I've done a few laps around it. It's uh it's pretty fun. It's interesting. Um it's a little bit longer than the OG map, but change is good. Um after about a week of playing, I definitely enjoy it. Um I hope that the oh god there's ice or something falling from my house i hope that the token is worthwhile i'm not really sure how it'll go um even if i get a few hundred dollars out of it i mean that's worthwhile in my opinion but we'll see what happens uh probably claim and then sell i don't really know we we might we might wait to even claim it to see how it goes before we even claim it you know and waste the money to claim um <clears throat> not really sure what the plan is but essentially uh i'm almost to twenty thousand tickets and um the more uh, i'm trying to think about what i was gonna say about the tickets uh so for every thousand tickets you get a spin of the um they're gonna be like little jackpot machines essentially and you get to spin the jackpot machine no that's so unfortunate oh god that's so unfortunate oh that's so unfortunate but you get to spin the jackpot machine and uh you get a chance at these badges and then the badges are essentially what's gonna determine determine the number of tokens that you get dropped when the token drop happens in march um so yeah essentially you get eight chances every five thousand um oh god i'm sorry i'm mad focused oh get me back in no oh i did i did i got there let's go that was a bad lap. That was honestly a bad lap, I feel like. I think that might be my fastest lap time on this map, though. Um, maybe not. I don't really know. Like I said, I've only done like four or five races here. Uh, but I like it. You get ex you get extra um, tickets. So, I mean, for an extra 15 seconds, I'll take an extra 10 tickets. It's, it's worthwhile, you know. Um, but yeah, so essentially every five uh so every thousand tickets that you gain from doing the races right you get one spin on the jackpot every five thousand grants you an extra three so essentially five is eight so when you get to 20 it's like 32 spins at the different badges that will give you the different token allowances so i'm super excited for that i kind of did research to kind of figure out what it was going to be like um seeing as the boards and the characters are valued at a decent price um even the pets are like a 0 0.06 floor right now which is pretty cool um i feel like that's a dude decent floor um <clears throat> i see people bust through and not hit it at all and it just i get so frustrated because i'm like how are you oh maybe they have it maybe it's in a different spot for them you know what i didn't think about that that way you can't like follow people's exact route hmm the plot thickens no i messed that all up This is definitely not worthwhile to go this way for me. I I lose too much time doing that. There we go. Try to time that perfectly every time. They make it so you can't ride the wall in here? What's going on? But, uh, yeah, I don't know. Uh, what was I saying? I was saying, essentially, since these are valued pretty decently, I feel like the token... I don't know, though. We see the same thing with Axie. Um slp and everything like that's not doing too hot so like i mean i guess it depends on what the demand is for the token and what's going to happen i feel like a lot of us are probably going to try to just sell off after doing all the grinding that we've done to get to where we are especially people that have been playing longer than i have um i think the tickets have been out since january so you've been able to gather tickets since january so people probably have a lot i mean 
if I have, I think I have um, almost like 30 hours of playtime at this point, um, which is about 500 races, almost 500 races. So, um, and uh, one thing too to mention, the guild did lower the amount that you got to do a day to 35. So. Um, that's pretty cool if you do want to join. Um, I don't know if we're giving out or if they are giving out Eververse scholarships anymore at this point, but um, there's always an option to win um, Legends of Inari uh, scholarships as well as um, other games in the future. So it could be worthwhile to join and just be around, you know, be in the community. Um, it's kind of like what I'm doing. But yeah, I don't know. I'm excited to see what happens uh, with the token <laughs> and uh, how well it's going to go for everybody because I don't know. I mean, it's a lot of time for people to put into games. I guess it works well for other countries. So, I mean, hopefully it works out for the people that really need the money the most. Um, you know, I find it I, like I'm doing this just to kind of have like extra financial freedom. Um, I do enjoy this game quite a bit, honestly. I'm addicted to trying to like beat people and there's like a little community, you know, um, obviously being in a guild, there's a lot of people. Uh, I think there's like 200 of us or so. Um, and, you know, like we have guild competition and stuff like that. Um, not like crazy payouts, but it's still worthwhile you know i mean if you need extra money or like you just play games and do all this stuff for fun anyways so um i'm sure eventually i will get burnt out and i probably won't want to play this anymore but who knows um they're supposed to be coming out with the turtle racing games so i'm excited to uh see um <clears throat> how that goes because you'll be able to bet i don't know if you're going to be betting their token tickets that you earn from the races or how that's going to work but um you know just a feature to be able to gamble in general would be kind of fun um full on dgen stuff right there honestly i don't even know um but the same thing with like uh what was i gonna say it's like the trip races that are going to be coming out for um the bio pills those will be pretty fun hopefully we can um holy crap get involved with that unfortunately i don't think i'm gonna have enough eth to grab a pill and a vape to get myself a craft so um thankfully the guild will be providing those and i know flip is pretty involved in the bio community so that's kind of like one of the big reasons why i did join the guild that i did join because like i know these dudes from one of the projects so I don't know it's worthwhile i guess to be involved for me at least i feel like it is um but yeah man you get i'm a prestige 74 uh i think my account is prestige 74 so to, based on your account prestige you get more tokens when i was a 94 i was getting um what was it uh when i was a 94 i think i was gaining like an extra five tickets so like it's not like a crazy gain between the 70s and the 90s but i don't know i could be completely wrong maybe a 98 would be insane to have but um i like this little character and i like this board but part of me honestly wants to grab a board myself and uh level it up and flip it because <laughs> like yeah but that's also another dope mechanic, right? Like you can buy a board here in the game and then level it up and then sell it for a higher price. So I don't know. I feel like it's the game's got a lot going for it. It's rather smooth. Um, like, I mean, it feels well graphically. It's not too intensive, but like, I mean, it's still visually pleasing enough that it's like not a big deal, you know, like I'm not going to complain about it um plus i feel like it'll get better over time not really positive as to what their goal is right um i don't know i'm excited to see 
where the game's gonna go what's gonna happen with the token the token drop should be in march i believe um so see what is causing that like how do i get the um nope that's unfortunate how do i get the double jump to happen like it'll just randomly give me a double jump like that i feel like that portal needs a little bit of love it does look a little bit weird when you go through it i'm not gonna lie but again this is a beta map um i remember the first day it was a little rough i played like two races and it was just it was rough i don't know if it was like server lag or what was causing it but um a lot of us were having issues but it seems very uh i gave it like two days and i did a lot of few races before this video started and um it seems a lot more polished uh it feels better um graphically i'm getting 300 frames per second right now which is insane um i also have a 3060 so i mean i have a good graphics card it's not great right not a 3090 but i got the oh god i could be doing so much better um whatever um but yeah man i mean averaging like 330 frames that's not bad um there looks like they're working on mobile support as well i'm sorry i'm just trying to like touch on all these topics while i play and it's like hard for me to like concentrate i guess i don't know um i hate saying um so much oh my god this game give me it these moving platforms are the worst the moving well the moving checkpoints are literally the worst thing ever oh i'm so sad that they added those no keep me on the wall bro damn i'm trash i am trash at this map but the extra ticket income is what's getting me like i mean i don't know i want the tickets i would like to hit like between 50 and 60 thousand tickets before the fucking the token drop so yeah that's really it that's all i got for you guys and girls and hopefully you enjoyed if you did like share comment subscribe all that good stuff um i'm not sure when we'll be back with more evaverse but we got a lot of uh other content coming we'll be back very shortly um i think we'll probably have a video friday doing more uh gameplay for um legends of Inari. and uh yeah so i will uh see you guys in the next one Yes.